What is going on guys, it's Brent Plays Madden, back again with another Madden Mobile video on the channel. And today we have Road to 99, Episode 9. Now, there's a few things we have to talk about, you know, Madden Futures is in the game. Which events you should play, what kind of filters you should use. And let's get right to it. So you go to Madden today, you see this event right here. Um, and basically, here we go. Uh, Madden Futures, you know, play this as much as you can, you get those 80 pluses. You basically put those 80 pluses into this 85 plus set, and you put those 85 pluses into the 90 plus set. Pretty easy, and you're like, oh, but Brent, 90 pluses? Don't that go for like 100k maybe? Maybe 50k? Nah. Nah, guys, you would be mistaken, because, you know, if you look up these 90 plus, what is it, Madden Futures? Right, and you put in about, I don't know, 400,000 coins. Oh, there's only a few up for 373s, 375? Wow, you can make a ton of coins off this. And if you're lucky and you pull an 80, I mean a 93 or a 94 or something out of that 90 plus set, then you're looking at maybe like 700, 800K, depending on how lucky you get. But... Jeez, there's none up. Oh, they are. Yes, yeah, see this guy? Okay, obviously they don't go for a million. But you could sell these pretty easily for 700k. And if you get one of the 90s or in late 91s, you can sell them, you know, for 400k. But it's a good coin method, guys. And okay, a lot of things sold. Tannehill, that was awful, Tannehill. This Tannehill did better. Okay. Uh, Munoz. Profit, profit, whatever. Good, good. That was good. We made some on fake one. And this is the big one, guys. Ray Guy gets us over a million coins. Okay, so now on to sniping. Um, again, you know, you gotta be careful with these filters because the auction house is a little weird right now. You can see how these punters are going for 85 or something. Yeah not really a snipe so you gotta watch out for that uh but oh oh 96 okay if this was a 94 i wouldn't take it but 96 punter for 113 i think is a good deal yeah because it's a 96 punter and for 111 all right yeah i'll take that 96 punter guy we just got two ray guys and i know they did drop in price but i think because they're 96s Oh, okay, maybe not. I thought they were going for at least 200k. Um, I'm still going to try to profit off of that. And I forgot to sell my whole bench, guys, from last time. I apologize. I forgot to sell them. But, okay, let's put them up for these. Um, I'm going to put I'm gonna put all these on the auction house, and I'll cut it out. Okay. All right, guys, I'm back. And so I posted everything. Uh, it took a little bit, but it's fine. So, okay. We have, why do we have 800k? Oh yeah, we sniped a few punters, okay. Snipe, maybe not, but we got them. So, okay, let's try this filter. See if it's still working, and if it's not, then that's unfortunate, but if it is, well, that would be helpful. Okay, so, let me check it out. 98, oh guard, 55. If it was a 96, I don't know if I would have taken it, but 98 definitely looks in my wheelhouse. Alright, definitely looks like it could be a... Well, it looks like it is a snipe, but we don't know for sure yet, so we'll see. Um, but okay. Actually, I'm pretty sure I know for sure. 98, Ogard, and we're going to search about 125k. Would I get him for 55? Yeah, that definitely is nice. Definitely is nice, boys. And boom, let's go. It's going for 130k. So yeah, it's still, still possible to snipe. Um, you know, I got this guy for 55,000 coins. He's going for 125, so that's good. Um, I think I'm just going to save everything else for the next episode. Improve the coin count. Hopefully a lot of this sells, guys. Um... You know, the punter, not sure if they were sniped. The other stuff from my bench I got, and Larry Allen was a snipe. Um, so that's going to be it for Road to 100, Episode 9, and uh, peace out.